All right, only way take a look around. is to get this and tie it to that so tree. Just how much do you owe uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the gun's way heist. Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure in it. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. Uh -huh. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partners with him. I have thoughts. I have some thoughts, but I'm going to prefer not to say it. <laughs> Very vague. What does Crispy mean by this? Mm. I'll say it later. Oh my god, what the hell am I doing? I'm just reversing. This is fine. Everyone is being very dramatic. Can I get back to my driver's seat, please? I'm making my way as fast as I can. Everyone's... Everyone's being so dramatic. It's so funny. fun, right? <laughs> See? Yeah, well, I'm definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No. What? But I will after this. Come on, guys, you're overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Exactly, Nathan was pretty fine with it. Oh. Ah. Ah, that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Uh, almost. Now, let's find our way in. All right. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Okay, let's not let's not be uh, presumptuous if it's here or not. Because based on where we're at in the game, <laughs> I can tell you one thing's for sure. It's not here. Hmm. Get in that way. Nope. But here might. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Rule of three. Let's see what we got here. Huh. Looks like there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Can you just blow this shit up? And can I just blow this shit up? Here, can I just do this instead? Heads up! God, Jesus! I said heads up! <laughs> Jeez. Wait up. Come on. Sam, if only you were with me these past three games, you would understand. <laughs> you would understand. It's never that simple. He seems excited. Oh, he's got a lot riding on this. Whoa. 
Okay. Cutscene. I'm not cutscene. Oh god. Coming. Another riddle. And this is definitely not going to be a shootout right here. <laughs> Check this out. St. Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas, too. And that's, uh... It's, it's Adam Baldridge. It's uh, Joseph Farrell. And it's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Mm -hmm. uh, maybe, maybe one of the arms? The dick. The dick. Shot. The dick. Come on. Boys, whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, <laughs> I think you might want to come take a look at this. The trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's, King's Bay. Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Hector, you're a goddamn genius. <laughs> hear that, Nate? Genius. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? <laughs> yeah, but which one? <laughs> I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? All right, let's get our guns out. Looks like we're not the first ones here. Oh, I got him. Holy shit. Oh, I got to take this fucker out. Oh, are you serious? Oh, nice one. Oh, that's Sam. How much ammo do I have of this? Only one. Get rid of this guy. Oh shit! Oh, that was lucky. <laughs> oh shit! Later, asshole. Jesus. Is that all of them? Well, let's hope so. Oh. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, fine. Sam? Yeah, over here. All right. Where'd we go? Hey, what are you doing? It's confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. They already have the locations too, right? Yep. I figured out the towers too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look. A little worn down. Right there, that's a match. There we go. Yeah, you sure? Because I mean, it could be this one too. Hmm. Crap. Uh, but still, three of us. Beats the hell out of twelve. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. No, no. Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Huh. Nate, he's right. 
These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. I mean, it makes sense. It's logical. Like, damn it. Three of us, and one of us has to go to one of the towers, and the two of us can uh, go to, to King's Bay. Cloud, you call us, okay? See you soon. I really love, like, you can see, like, the sweat, like, in their faces. Come on, Nate. You gotta hurry. Yeah. And you guys definitely see, like, the pits, the pit stains or whatever. Like, they're sweating right there. Chapter 11, hidden in plain sight. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? <laughs> oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. We've seen crazy before. Oh yeah. Excuse me. Move. This is really lively. I love it. <laughs> oh, a lemur. this mm, he's right it does smell good that's the chicken I can't really tell what that is are those burgers wrapped in leaves and lettuce or whatever oh my god that looks so good hey here we go locked we can't just sneak. casually Sweetly. enter. Implied by the use of the word sneak. <laughs> I just got that. Oh my god. Um. Whoa. window over there is broken. Yes. I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. Damn! Look at this town. Long way down. You okay back there? Keep your pace. I'll keep mine. Yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right? I would love to live in one of those towns okay. one of these days. Like, it's so okay. small, pretty. Looks really nice. I'd be into that. Wow. This place is in much better shape than the other towers. Edward England's sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. It is. Who's in charge of this clock tower? <laughs> like, who operates this? <gasps> oh, the coin. Now, what do you bet? <laughs> Zodiacs. <laughs> Look, there's Leo. Ah, and Taurus. Four signs. Uh, four bells. Isn't Bell cancer Bell. like the crab? And these things in the middle of the floor look like locks. Ugh. <sighs> Pisces is the bells. twin fish. The two fishes or whatever. <laughs> this is definitely the place. Call Sam. Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, Taurus. Voicemail. Hey, Sam. Looks like we're at the right tower. Call us. They don't have the best coverage in the city. <sighs> no reason to wait. I'll be right back. Oh, boy. I'll be damned. 
Check it out, Sully. The clock still works. Yeah, I noticed. I'm trying not to get tangled in those gears up there. You bet. Ooh. Ugh. Get up there. Climb up here. Up here. And up here. Yeah, that'd be very fucking painful. Oh, good. Huh. Trust me. Where have I heard that before? Huh. Time and time again. Okay, so hold on a second. This is Leo. Okay, so I need to ring Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo. Okay, so let me get to Scorpius. Or Scorpius. Oh, there we go. Okay, this is correct. Yes. Scorpio. That Avery was a Scorpio. <laughs> I'm a Sagittarius. So painful to the ears. Okay, moving on to the next one. Aquarius, and he's right there. Nathan, oh my god, come on. If you don't put that journal away, oh my god. Alright, Aquarius, and then it's Leo. Oh, he's nice people. Really though? Aquarius, always nice people. <laughs> Should have brought some earplugs for that. Let's see here. Okay, then it's Leo. Yep, Leo and Taurus. Ooh, hold on. Oh wait, what am I doing? He's right here. Get the best angle. And I'm assuming Taurus is all the way up to the top. right there. Come on. <laughs> okay. Nathan, climb up, climb up. Up, up. Ooh. Don't throw up now. Wait, we're supposed to over there. Okay, got it. One... Sally, any word from Sam? Not yet. Nah, he's probably fine. He just forgot to charge his phone. Mm -hmm. All right, Taurus, give it to me. Give it to me loud. Give it to me loud. Damn. 
One more bell. Hmm, convenient. Honestly, all this ringing in his ears, it's gonna be like very damaging to him when he gets older. I mean, thank goodness I brought like earplugs when I was at the music festival. In Oakland last year, it was for um, for Porter Robinson. I really love his music; it's really nice. Um, and yeah, it can get loud. <laughs> it was a really good, good set. Him and all the other artists that came before him. second I need to uh, adjust those hands alright that's good it was a really good show I mean, I obviously bought, went there for Porter Robinson, but everyone else that was there, yeah, they're really no, good. No, 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 no. Skrillex set, um, it was like messing up. It kept on looping back, <laughs> but luckily Porter Robinson, he came out and helped Skrillex out, and it was like full circle, like what he said, like Skrillex was like the master or whatever, and. Porter was the noob, and now is the master helping out the other master. It was really nice. Good show. Good good sets. Very emotional. It was really great singing along to his lyrics. Yeah, there you are. <laughs> on the way back home, uh, on the airplane, I was just thinking about his show, okay and. And you know, I I just I just teared up just thinking about what I experienced, and it was really nice. I loved it so much. And I'm down to see Port Robinson again at some point. Okay, Sully, I made it. This is be loud. the loudest one yet. No promises. I'm gonna have to bring it myself. <laughs> You're gonna have to tough it out, Nathan. You're gonna have to tough it out. Ah, here we go. Oh god, this is gonna be so bad for the ears. He's gonna be so deaf. Oh no. Oh. Get up, up, up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. Nothing. No building is safe. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, Sally. Oh, shit. At least I got the door open, though, huh? <laughs> That's one way to do it. You all right? I don't know yet. No. You? No building is safe from Nathan Drake. If he's in your house, your church, your McDonald's restaurant, watch out because that entire building might just come tumbling down. You want it? Yeah, sure. Why not? Let's see what's down here. Thanks for the gesture. Piles of gold and jewels. Sam, 
Finally, you okay? Just search my town. I, I got nothing. Yeah? No. We're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. <coughs> you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. Yeah, it's, it's not going to be gold and jewels or whatever. Sorry to disappoint you. But it's another lead of where we'll go next in the game. <laughs> Sully, way ahead of you. It's puzzle time. <laughs> Are those our boys? Yep. Henry Avery, Thomas too. Partners in crime. Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever? <laughs> <laughs> there are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah, they got those star patterns on them. Just gotta manipulate them. But which way are they supposed to go? Nope, this way. They connect. Whoa. This shit is very elaborate. <laughs> Yeah, d just a second. More pirate symbols. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. Meaning... Oh, okay. What? I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. I say we see where that door leads. Yeah, um... Still hoping for some treasure, yeah? You and me both. Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condit. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. Okay, can I already see what I need to look well, for? that mustache. It's almost as impressive as yours. Yeah, it's all right. Hey, look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, you're right. Ah, uh, that's right. Condit went by Billy One Hand. <laughs> Guess he had one made. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. See, yeah. I'm not just a pretty face. That's Anne Bonnie. Bonnie was a redhead. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Those Avery and two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? I bet these line up, too. Hmm. <laughs> So this should be like this. Oh no, right here. Baldridge, right here. See, they connect. And this one goes right here. Perfect. So, yep, they're all looking down. And then the, and the black looking figure that's like facing down. Yep, the devil right there. Bam, bam, and bam. Add another doorway. Yeah. So, who are these guys? That's. Um, they are. Uh, <laughs> you don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know. So we're stuck. No, we're not stuck. Would you give me your phone. What? You're gonna phone a friend? Close. Text a brother. Hey, Sully. <laughs> Come on, get in the frame. Get in the frame. Get in the frame. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> There. You know, these are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Okay. Doubt it. Just saying. William Mays. American? Yeah, from Rhode Island. Just like Thomas, too. Oh, Jesus. Where is this? Oh, wait. What is this? Hmm. No? Hmm. 
Those are not it? Okay. Is it on his coat? Oh, it's right here. Here we go. See that one right there? Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? It took I'll him that long? Later. For now, just tell me who's who. Well, the, the dolphins are Richard Want, the trident is Joseph Farrell, and the two hands with the pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet, but I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Books, globe. This Want guy looks like a scholar. Hey, Richard Want. He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he and Baldridge were in a best wig competition. <laughs> oh, what the hell? I'll just lift this painting up. Hey, Sully, give me a hand. You got it. Thanks. <sighs> Straight. This he guy cares. Oh my God. I care. This guy looks a little bit. I guess intimidating is one word. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather be anywhere else. <laughs> here it is, right here. There. Okay. Let's see where they all go. Oops. Okay. I think because right here. I think. Let me see. No. Wait a minute. No. Right here. I think. Let me see. Oh, this music. Oh, yeah, no, that's right, that's right. Which means that... This should go... No? Wait a minute. The hell? Huh. Because I'm pretty sure that's... Okay. Okay, well... Okay, so the dark-looking fish... Or dolphin... Is facing the right... Upside-down trident... Just have to figure out where... So I don't try to. Hmm. No, it's not right. Okay. Ugh. Oops. Okay. Let me see what can. What if we do it like this? Okay, no, I don't think that's... Okay, what if we'd follow... Hold on. Oh, here we go. Oh, perfect. Okay, so up and down left and I'm not sure what that looks like oops I think it's like this what's this there we go a 
Okay. So who do we have here? Uh, you know, I'm honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. Huh? No, I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful. That's all. Aha. Uh -huh. Nice. <laughs> hey. What up? Sully. Face the camera. <laughs> Come on, face the camera. <laughs> Jesus, how many more rooms left? Holy shit. Oh no. Shit. What happened here? A torch probably fell or something. Come on, let's see what's left. Oh fuck. I don't recognize this guy. Looks a lot younger than the other pirates. Right here? That's one. Oh, I see the other one right here. Oh, Sam texted me back. Left to right. Now, ah, see there, Sully? Turns out Sam doesn't know everything either. Loading is unseen. Uh huh. Huh. No name. This guy's getup looks Moorish. Found the stars, but who are you? It's on his sash right here. Huh. Yazid al Basra. Looks Indian. Close. Muggle. Wait, aren't the muggles the ones Avery robbed? Honor among thieves. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like that's ever the case. And his satchel. Stout little fellow. All right. Bam. All right. What do we got here? All right. I got the names of two of them. Oh, you should still be able to figure this out. Okay. Uh, England. Oh, I think I see one of the solutions at least. I think. I think. Hmm. <gasps> okay, though well, that's right. So if you're right here. <gasps> oh, there we go. There we go. Upside down. A uh, thing sideways, upside down, and Tiger is like facing down <laughs> or whatever. Upside down. Is that even upside down? Oh no, that's the side. Upside down and in there. Oh. Ah. We got it. What do we got? Uh, not sure yet. Maybe send it to Sam? Really? Hey, no. you're the one who said he's the pirate expert. Just saying. Uh, I can't take a picture of Sully anymore. Goddamn. All right. Okay, that's one. <gasps> We're going to take a picture of him right here. Oh, I can't. Not anymore. And two. Last one. All right, let's see what he makes of them. You know, All right. that kind of looks... Huh. What are you doing? You just took pictures. <laughs> Hold that. You know, Avery's recruits wouldn't have had smartphones, obviously. Obviously. So this would have been the only way for them to get to the next clue. <laughs> These are clues. Hmm. Let me see. Ooh. Voila. <laughs> oh. All right. These could be trade winds. Yeah. And these look like latitudes. Yeah. And I would guess that we are packing our bags again, boy. <laughs> exactly. What? Pro Deus quod licentia. Translation? Oh, no, it can't be. Can't be what? Oh my god, so obvious. Nate. <laughs> He's doing it again. Why didn't I see this before? Oh my god. for the beautiful mind shit. What the hell are you talking just, just, about? Hang on. Sam, did you get the photos? 
<laughs> Here I am. I'm calling what I thought was Sullivan's phone, and look who picks up. How you been, Nate? Hey, Rafe. <laughs> been a long time. How did you get this number? Sullivan leave it on a cocktail napkin? <laughs> I wish. <laughs> that only would have cost me a few shots of rum, right? No, no, I had to pay top dollar to find you guys. Yeah. I hope you didn't spend too much on this whole Avery thing. I hear the competition's fierce. Yeah, you pulled off some clever moves there. But in the end, all that matters is who gets to Avery's treasure first. <laughs> well, that sounds like a bet. Hmm. Hey, Nate, One you know that I will win, of course. Game, partner. Well, she prefers to mitigate unnecessary risks. Wow. Rafe Adler taking orders from somebody else. Oh, how times have changed. Look, Nate, I'm gonna make you a one-time offer here. You drop everything. Go home, live your life. I'm willing to forgive and forget. For old time's sake. Yeah, as right. Sounds, Rafe. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm not normally the kind of guy who likes to quit while he's ahead. Okay. Rodeus quote will set you. Forgotten liberty. Oh no. These are nice pictures, Nate. <laughs> Composition. You hacked our phones. You stole my cross. Listen, Nate. If you're half as smart as you think you are, you'll accept my offer. What's it gonna be? <sighs> Listen, as nice as it's been to catch up with you, I really gotta take this call, so. Well, Nate, one more thing. Nate! What? You, uh, you do realize that your phones are equipped with GPS, right? I'll see you soon, buddy. All right. Time to destroy our phone. Shit. Let me guess. Goons with guns on their way here now. Sam, <laughs> for God and liberty. Nathan, do you understand what this means? Sam, listen to me. Get off the streets right now and destroy your phone. What's going on? Rape knows where we are. We Go. Oh. Sam? Sam! Damn it. Hey. I'll buy you a new one. Look at the new Apple iPhone 15 or whatever that's coming out with. What what is the fucking difference? I have no idea. Anyways, uh cliffhanger ending to the video. Let's go.